Hello everyone, this is Miss Rachel once again. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to discuss the different types of computers and the purpose of each type. What is computer? Computer is an electronic machine that helps people perform different tasks. It is used to write letters, draw pictures, make calculations, play games, chat with our friends, and send electronic email. Nowadays, computers come in different forms and sizes according to your needs. The first one here is desktop. What is a desktop? It is a personal computer or PC designed for regular use at a single location on or near a desk or table due to its size and power requirements. It is the most common type of computer. It has a monitor, a keyboard, a mouse, and a system unit. Desktops are generally cheaper than laptops and have a longer lifespan. Next, we have here a laptop. As you can see in the picture, a laptop is a portable computer with an internal battery that we can use almost anywhere. Laptops are generally more expensive than desktops. Instead of a mouse, laptop has touchpads which is built in with the integrated keyboard. Next, we have netbook. A notebook or netbook is a PC or personal computer that is similar to a laptop as you can see here in the picture. But it is cheaper, lighter, and a lot small. Netbooks are great for businessmen because they can use them on the move and they can also easily put them in a briefcase or shoulder bag without taking up too much space. Next, we have mini computer. As you can see in the picture, the size is a medium-sized and mid-range computer. It is cheaper and smaller than a laptop and netbook. Next, we have tablet. A tablet is a touch-sensitive screen or touch screen to allow us to move around the screen and type words and numbers. Tablets are bigger than smartphones and are more limited to what they can do compared to a laptop or a notebook. An example of tablet is the iPad for Apple and top for Samsung and other brands. Next, we have smartphones. These are cell phones that can also do things similar to what other computers can do, including surfing the internet. Next, we have Games Console. The purpose of Games Console is to play video games. Like most modern devices, you can now access the internet play other types of media, and talk with friends. An example of the game's console are PS3 and the Xbox 360. We have here in the picture, PS3 and the Xbox 360. Next is a mainframe computer. This type of computer is used by large companies to service their customers. A 
ATM machines in the country are linked to their bank's powerful mainframe computers. This computer stores data about every customer. The most powerful mainframes are called supercomputers. It is the largest, fastest, most expensive type of mainframe computers. The mini computer is smaller than a mainframe. It is larger than the computer you have at home. It is used by medium-sized companies. It can store all the data that is needed by a small company. Lastly, we have wearable computers. And what are wearable computers? These are computers that can be worn on the body. First, we have the Google Glass. And what is a Google Glass? It is a wearable computer featuring a head-mounted display in the form of eyeglasses. The Google Glass functions as a hands-free smartphone, letting users access the mobile internet browser, camera, maps, calendar, and other apps by voice commands. Next, we have a smartwatch. A smartwatch is a wearable computing device that closely resembles a wristwatch or other timekeeping device. In addition to telling time, many smartwatches are Bluetooth capable. To use a smartwatch, you need a smartphone. On your smartphone, you install the apps that comes from with the smartwatch. To name a few, these are the apps that you need to install in your smartphone. We have here the music, the Bluetooth, email, camera, and your messenger. Next, we have the Zipad. A Zipad is like a smartwatch, but it has a feature similar to laptop computer. So, these are the types of computers that come in different forms and sizes according to your needs. First, a desktop, laptop, netbook, mini computer, tablet, Smartphone, Game Console, Mainframe, Supercomputer, and Wearable Computers. Now, if you are given a chance to make your own computer, what do you think our future computers be like? Oh,